Perhaps you have these two things that you probably have it, but you don't use it anymore. Maybe you're planning of getting rid of it. So the two things that I have right now that I did not use for years, and I found out this time that I can still use them. So for example, this one here, this is a CD graphics uh, karaoke player. For those of you that does not know what it is, you pretty much have to purchase a DVD or a CD. So pretty much it comes, so you purchase something like this and it's like your minus one and uh, the lyrics will show over there. So again, if you have this one, uh, I don't suggest you throw it out because you can still use it. Mainly you can use it as your speaker. So for example, you don't have yet this portable speaker, you can use that as speaker. It's actually even louder that than this one. So anyway, um, the other things that I have here that I did not use for a long time is this one. So the magic sing. The reason, the reason why I did not use this one for a long time because only the minus one plays with the video, but when you sing on it, the microphone doesn't work anymore. So that's uh, mainly the reason why this was in a corner for a long time. Now I am going to show you uh, how to connect uh, this magic thing to this uh, uh, CD graphics uh, karaoke player and we're going to connect also uh, we were going to connect uh, this two to the uh, V9 sound card and uh, since as I mentioned this one is already uh, uh, the microphone part is already broken I will be using the BM800 condenser microphone the purpose for this connection is that the video is connected over here but the audio is connected to the sound card and will come out to this one okay if it sounds complicated i am going to show you um, how is the connection is going to be let me show you the wires we will be using so these are the wires we will be using first this one is for for example if you're going to do a live streaming or recording you will use this uh, from here the sound card to the gadget you will be using for recording or live streaming and this cord here is for audio so the audio from here you will use this one another way of uh, of getting the audio from the magic sing is using this cord i'm going to show you how to use this one as well later and here is another cord we will be using okay and just to show you uh, the end part of this magic sing looks like that okay so this is for the power of the magic sing and this is for the audio video and uh, uh, audio video to wherever you wanted to connect it now let's start the connection let me just turn this one to the back because that's where we're going to connect all these wires okay so this is the power for this machine and on here we will only use this bottom part over here so video in so uh, which means we're going to connect video from outside will go inside to this machine so as i showed you earlier this is the end part of uh, this uh, magic thing so we will only use uh, this one to connect uh, to here so that is uh, video in so we'll connect that and now I'm going to show you how to connect this so cord. So this two cords here, the RCA part, we're going to connect to uh, this one here. So pretty much uh, white to white, red to red. Now the other end, we will connect to the sound card. We'll connect it under earphone or headphone so we're going to connect again from aux here aux in we're going to connect the other end to the sound card under earphone so you can you can just select uh, either earphone or headphone so let's uh, say headphone this time and now let's uh, connect this is for the power of the magic sing so this is the magic sing this is for the power so again i showed you this earlier this is the power for that so i connected it already i plugged it in already to a power source okay there it is and this one we will use this to connect the audio that will come out from this magic sing to go in 
to the sound card. Okay, so again, so from here, again, this is from the Magic Sing. So this too, we will only use this one. We're not gonna use this one, only this one. So you need this kind of, of end for that. I think this is a, f uh, a female RCA. Okay, so white to white and red to red. So we will not be using this one. And the other end, we will connect to the V9 sound card under music. Because what our purpose here is the music from the uh, Magic Sing will go inside to this V9 sound card and the headphone here, that's gonna be our source. So the audio here will go into this machine. Of course, we will not forget to connect our condenser microphone. So you can just select either capacitor one or capacitor two. So let's select capacitor two. Okay, so I just move the wires to the back so it's not messy. Okay, so now that all the wires are connected, we can start now turning on this machine and also the sound card. And we can also turn the magic sing. Okay, there it is. Okay, so as you notice, the audio will come out now from here. Okay, so let's give it a little sample. Let's select a song and let's just sing with it. Let's say eight zero. So you you select the song from here, eight zero three five. Just a heads up, you can uh, control the volume from here or from the V9 sound card and also the volume from here. So I'm just gonna show you if you click music from there and arrow up, that turns the volume up as well. So lots of options. Okay, let's uh, play the song. So to play the song is from here. Uh, simply hit that uh, play uh, button right there, play or stop. Okay, I'm just gonna hang on to this one. Okay, let's play the music. If you think that your microphone is too loud, you can always control your volume from the um, from the sound card. So let's just lower it a little bit. Testing one, two. So maybe that should be good. Sound check. Testing one, two. Okay, uh, let's uh, play again our karaoke song. Let's just simply turn the volume up from here. Only you can feel that space inside So there's no sense pretending Okay, so that's pretty much it. So you will notice in this recording right now or for example, if I'm doing a live streaming that is not uh, connected, I just played that way and it's not connected to the gadget that I'm using for recording show you now if for example you wanted to go live streaming and or record this or record this uh, song to your phone okay now i'm going to connect the the sound card to the gadget i'm using for recording or live streaming okay so now we will use this uh, cord so again you get this one when you purchase the sound card and you can just select either live one or live two for recording or live streaming so it says there let's just select live one and the other end we're going to connect to the gadget we will use for live streaming or recording since i'm going to use uh, iphone i will be needing an adapter so something like that for my recording okay so there it is Okay, so this is now a sample if you are doing a live streaming or, or recording this uh, song right now. Okay, so again, let's turn the volume up from the sound card. So the audio that you will be hearing right now would be the same as you're doing a live streaming or recording. The feeling I never outgrew Though each and every part of me has tried Okay, let's uh, stop it from there. I hope you've noticed the difference of the audio quality that it's way better if the gadget you're using to record or live streaming is connected to the sound card compared 
uh, to the one which is not connected to the sound card. So again, I showed you earlier that I can use this cord as well to connect the audio from this magic thing to the sound card instead of uh, using this one. So instead of using this one, I'm just going to show you. So instead of using this one, I will use this one. Uh, for example, if you don't have this uh, type of cord to connect to your magic thing, you can use this one as well. So simply connect this one, same thing to the uh, background music from your sound card. So it's right there. So music, the one that says music, and then the other end, connect it to the magic thing. So the magic thing has a port for headphones. So I will show you, it's right there. So just connect the other end to here. So again, the one that has two lines only. Okay, so if you play something here, let's say, let's play something. Okay, I don't know what's that song, but let's play it. Okay, of course the volume here is down, so you won't hear anything. There it is. So same thing, if you know that song, you can sound check, testing one, two, testing one, two. So there it is. So it's either you use that chord or if you want to use this one, whatever you have, you can connect your uh, magic thing to your uh, sound card. And that's it for today. Thanks again, guys, for watching. Until next time.